What's up everybody, this is Bruce, aka Geektacular, and today I'm going to be unboxing a game that just came out today. Um, this is Trials Fusion for PS4. Uh, if you're not familiar with Trials, it's actually a physics-based uh, motocross type of game. Sort of like the modern day equivalent of like Excite Bike, basically, except of course it's in like 3D and they, you can make all kinds of crazy levels and stuff. It has a really big community. Um, it's really big on people making custom maps. Um, they give you all kinds of stuff for the map editor. People make like stuff where you go upside down. They make these crazy giant, you know, jumps and things and just all kinds of wacky stuff. Um, maps that are like super hard. The ones that they usually ship with Trials games are pretty awesome too. Um, the one game that I played the most is Trials Evolution for Xbox 360. Um, and now that I have a PS4, I was really waiting for uh, Trials Fusion to come out for PS4 so that I could take my Trials experience uh, A to next gen and B to uh, PlayStation. So I'm really excited that Trials finally has a next gen uh, game and that it's out for PS4 also. Um, it also comes out for Xbox One and PC as well. Uh, so if you have any of those, you can pick it up for that uh, as well. So I'm actually going to go ahead uh, and I'll show you the sticker real quick because this is on the outside. Uh, so this is coming off here in a second. Um, so this is the $40 retail version of Trials Fusion. I think the downloadable one is $20 with just the game. So if you just want the base game, you can get it for 20 bucks. This one um, is the retail version that's just $40, so it's twice as much. But it comes with a season pass, which includes six uh, DLCs, which are... Um, all the DLCs that will be released within the next year, plus five kind of exclusive um, items that you can get for buying the retail box instead of the, the half-price uh, digital standard version. So let me go ahead and open this. And yeah, Trials, if, once you, if you've never played Trials Evolution, once you start playing it, it's really addictive. I was addicted to Evolution for quite a while. Um, I haven't played it much these days anymore. Um, I kind of just got bored of, of all the uh, the tracks and everything that were there, but this will have a ton more stuff, uh, more unlockables, all new levels, all new physics, you know, that kind of stuff. So it'll probably feel the same, but um, with a little bit... Nicer sheen and a whole bunch of new stuff to do, so I'm looking forward to it. And you really don't have to be into, like, motocross or anything. Like, I know nothing else really about motocross, or I'm not, like, into it. I don't do it or anything like that in real life. But, um, like I said, it's kind of like the modern-day version of, like, Excite Bike or something in that, like, you basically, it's sort of a two, more or less um, kind of 2D scrolling sort of thing uh, where you go around the track but there's all these jumps like here and stuff like that and ramps that you basically have to tilt your um, bike and you can control your throttle and your brake and everything and eventually it gets really hard and there's some levels where you have to like land your front tire on something and then like brake and then like pivot and sort of hop off of it onto something else like there's all there's crazy stuff like that too so it's not just writing down tracks. Um, but like I said, it, it's really big for uh, the community because they give you a track editor and uh, a really easy way to upload your, your tracks so everybody else can grab them. So it's one to four players. DualShock 4 supports remote play like all PS4 games. So if you have a Vita, you can remote play this uh, if you're at home or what, uh, whatnot. It has online play, two to four network players, 1080p, Unlike the Xbox One version, which is 900p, and or 920p or what? I, I think it's 900p. Yeah. Um, all I know is that the Xbox One version does not run on 1080p natively, at least not upon release. Um, so if you're watching this later, maybe it will. But uh, on launch, uh, it runs on 1080p only on PS4, not on Xbox One, uh, and of course on PC it'll run, you know, high res and whatnot. So it requires. Um, five, a little over five gigs minimum of hard drive space to install it. There's all the fine print. It's an all-region game, so it can be, um, it can be imported and exported. So, I think there's actually a code in here. So, I 
obviously don't want to show that to you. Um, if you care, this is the insert that comes in there. Um, on the back side is your code for uh, your season pass, which includes all the DLC and all that. Um, so I did indeed get that. And also unlocks all the extra items and stuff too. So here is the game disc itself. Trials Fusion for PS4. Here is the manual. Not many PS4 games actually come with uh, paper manuals anymore, but uh, it's never a bad sight. So basically has ads for um, the Uplay system, um, various warranty warnings in different languages and stuff. So, um, so if you want to see what the ad in English looks like, it's advertising Uplay syncing it with your Uplay account. Um, then uh, it tells you that the retail version includes the season pass and uh, these five individual items. So if you're wondering, they're all aesthetic, um, but this is what it includes. The Proud Hero outfit, the Crater Hazmat suit. So those are two complete outfits. Um, oops, sorry about the focus there. It has the Thrill Seeker Rhino helmet. So it's a helmet that looks like a rhinoceros. And then it has two body kits um, for two of the specific bikes. It has the Fallen Angel bike upgrade and the Light of the Skies bike upgrade. So all of this is just aesthetic. It's just outfits, helmets, um, different looks for the, for the bikes. Doesn't have any performance benefit. So, but a nice little bonus. Um, and then the six DLC packs um, that are coming out within the next year will have new tracks, new items, new bike parts, and new rider gear. So this will get you free access. Uh, automatic access to all six of those as they come out. So, um, with the amount of time that I spent playing Trials Evolution, forty dollars is a very fair price uh, in my opinion. Um, and there's, it's a growing, it's a, it's an ever growing community. So, you know, there's basically going to end up being an endless amount of tracks you can download from other people and things like that. Um, there's never a lack of challenge in the game. Um, even if you beat, you know, all of the built-in levels. Uh, and as you saw, they're coming out with six DLC packs this year. So even even if you beat all of these out of the box, um, they're coming out with more in a, every couple months. So that's really good to hear. I hope Trials Fusion goes on for a long time, and I hope it's awesome. I haven't actually played it yet since I just unboxed it. But um, if it's anything like Trials Evolution, I'm really psyched to play it. I'm probably going to spend way too long playing this game <laughs> over and over and over again. It's kind of like torture uh, when you get to a track that you can't beat because you basically, and it, it keeps count of how many times you try. Um, and I've tried things hundreds of times in a row. Like it's, it's like you're torturing yourself, but you just like got to do it. You just get in the mode, you know, where you like, you just have to beat this one part or whatever. So it's actually, it's really, really fun. Um, so if you've never played a Trials game, I would suggest picking it up, even just the $20 uh, digital version. Uh, but if you think that you're going to get all the DLCs and stuff, you might as well pick up the, the retail box. And I kind of like having stuff, you know, in the box anyway. Um, so yeah. If you like this video, um, go ahead and click thumbs up down below. That would be awesome. And if you like video game unboxings, anime unboxings, that kind of stuff, go ahead and click subscribe down below, and that way you'll get notified whenever I upload any new videos. So thanks for checking this out, and I will see you next time.